You want to pick up those new players that just dropped today? If you want safe, fast, and the cheapest MUT21 coins, head on over to EasyMUT.com and use my coupon code TNIC for 5% off of your order and to support me. The link is down in the description. Go check it out, guys. All right, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. We just reported the variety pack opening, so go check that out if you guys have not already. If you want for some golden tickets, might not end it too well, but, you know, we ripped them anyway. If you want to see what I got, go check that out. But in this video, we're having some pro fantasies. Um, hopefully they're feeling good. They still have the odds not shown. Yeah, they do. So they just change them all the time. Sometimes they'll be juice. Sometimes they won't be. So we're going to get into it. Make sure you drop a like helps out a lot. You guys have been going crazy lately. As always, let's get into it. Sure. Some pro fantasies. We got some coins to mess with now because we ripped the bundle. We got, we had some extra, we had some extra coins now. So, you know, let's rip a couple hundred thousand of some pro fantasy packs. We haven't ripped these in a little bit. Um, yeah. You guys are getting someone else, someone else got mad about me taking the uh the golds over the elites so i mean obviously they're probably new to the channel but gotta explain it every once in a while why i do it because i do 50 exchange sets um you need 77 to 79 overall gold players to do them and i have a surplus of elites so i don't really need to take the elites over the gold so i grab the golds over the elites because i'd rather put them in a set than have them sit in my binder and do nothing so you got an 86 overall lance allworth which is kind of bad which is kind of bad but i don't know i i got some faith in these packs dude i got some faith in these packs i'm feeling like this might be bold but i'm feeling a golden ticket pull you know what i'm saying we're getting a golden ticket out of this no there's no shot we pull a golden ticket out of this dude i'm just trying to hype myself up i'm just trying to hype myself up so i pull something good because that's how ea is if you're hyped up and you like believe you're gonna get something good ea will give you something good but if you think it's gonna be bad they they'll just give you complete trash so i gotta make them think then I'm going to pull something good so I actually get something good. Or I could just tell them I'm not going to spend money anymore. And they'll, like, insert awesome cards into the pack. Like, watch. I'll, I'll test that out again next pack. It's worked, like, most of the times when I've said that. So we'll take Lawrence right here. EA, if you're listening, I'm never spending money on the game again. If you don't give me some fire out of this pack. I'll never drop another dime into any Madden game. Like, bro. We just profited off of one card. Like, that's all I got to say. That's all I have to say, and they just immediately give you good cards. And we're not even to the second round yet. Oh, never mind. They were feeling not that generous. But, I mean, 82 overall coin card, 38k. That's doubled our coins. So, I mean, I'll take it. They passed they pass the, the fake money, the, or the money check. So, that makes sense. Dude. I want to do it again. I want to try it again. Uh, give me KJ. KJ, for the reason that I just explained a couple of minutes ago. Um, EA, same thing as last time. You don't give me some fire. I'm never spending money again on any Madden game. I'll never rip another bundle. Here we go. Let's see if it clutches up with, like, an actual good pull. Not just some profit. So we got some solid golds out of the first. Canvas Hero, 82. Okay, wow, it failed. It actually failed. And that's how I'll take the 82, because both of those golds were under 77 overall, so they only go into the 82 overall, the 50 sets. So I don't really have too much value for those, other than when Julio's card was popping. But, I mean, I'll take an Elite over some 76s. We get a Vita Vea there, Chris Godwin, Whitley Merciless. That's not bad out of the first. That's not a bad first round. We need these second rounds to begin clutching up. We get a quarterback number four and James Radbury. I'm going to take the Ed Oliver because I want to get these sets done. I want to start pumping out some Dion's. Um, but let's keep going, dude. I've got faith in these pro fantasies. I love these packs, bro. I love these packs. I need them to be some heat. We get a legend right here. 87 Lance Allworth out of the first. That's a step in the right direction for profiting. Come on. Man, they're killing me. Yay! What did you do to these packs? What are the odds looking like right now? The odds are probably looking very bad. Let's rip a get a gold, dude. Let's rip a get a gold. Team of the week. Eric Murray. That's not too bad for 5,000 coins, right? Let's rip another get a gold. Are get a golds the move? 50 card? 86 Dion? Are singular get a golds the play? Hold on. Harvest player. 80 overall Zach Moss. You know, let's rip five Get a Golds. Let's rip five of these. Dude, is Get a Golds to play? Are Get a Golds to play? God, that was terrible grammar. You get Aaron Donald. Okay, so the second I actually put coins into it, 
And not just by singles, they turn to trash. Robbie Anderson, all right. Man, they're rigged! They're so rigged! Are you kidding? There's no way the singulars are heat, but then when you buy a bundle of five, they turn into Garbo. That does not make any sense. Hold on. Hold on, wait a minute. Wait a minute! Dude! We're getting not that bad pulls out of singulars. And the bundles are just trash. Hold on. We're gonna do two more of these. Okay, there's a gold. And then we said we're gonna do two more, so we got we gotta do it. We gotta do one more. We gotta do this one last one. And then we're gonna get back to the pro fantasies. Okay, so they are bummy. They are oh wait, we'll take that. 640 training, not too bad. Uh yeah, they definitely are bummy. Get a gold, they hype me up for a little bit. I thought there was I thought there was some potential there, but there's just not. There just isn't. We get a Mike McGlinchey right there. Okay. I love pro fantasies, dude. I just wish the odds were shown. I wish I knew what I was ripping. Oh. I wish I knew what I was ripping, dude. Like, I want to know if I should actually even have, like, faith in them. Because when they first came out, I was like, yeah, dude, I'm going to pull heat from these. I'm expecting good cards. And now the, the odds are not showing. So I'm like, eh, is it good odds or is it bad odds? Or am I just getting hype over nothing? I don't know. They're hit or miss packs. And, and we're missing. We're doing a whole lot of missing right now. We'll take Jesse James. At least we got a lot of coins, dude. We got a lot of coins and an AD Redux still on the block that no one has bought yet. Because I'm being greedy. I'm on PC. I have the only one on the auction block. So, you know, I might have cranked the price up um, a couple hundred thousand coins waiting for someone to actually finally buy it when they need it. Um, because no one else can pull it. So, that's my plan with that. We'll take the 87 Cliff Harris. It's not too bad. Is that our best pull yet? An 87 overall, Cliff Harris. I mean, not really. I think the Ingram's the best pull because he probably goes for the most coins if you really think about it that way. We got to get at least, like, one cool animation before I end this, right? Like, we got to get something, bro. We got to get something. They're killing me with the pro fantasy packs. Today's videos was some trash pack luck, bro. Today's videos was some trash pack luck. But at least I'm going to start recording that Texans rebuild today. That's going to be fun. I can't wait to do that, actually. With the rebuild, do you guys think I should import? Oh, we get lights. Okay. 90 John Hanna. Let's go. And a George Kittle. Okay. But for the um, rebuild, if anyone watches the video this far, let me know in the comments. Would you rather see me import the draft class with Trevor Lawrence and all them into the game and, like, redo the draft or import the roster after the team already drafted? Like, what would you guys want to see me do? Probably, I don't know. I don't know what to do. I don't know what people would rather see. Would you rather see me be the GM and redraft while everyone else redrafts? Or should I just go with the, like, start it in, like, 2022 rosters? You know what I mean? Or 2021, 2022 rosters. I'm not too sure what to do. I don't know what people would rather see. I feel like I should just let the draft be how it was. And then, um, and then redraft the next year and the year after that and just build it from what they have as of, like, today. I feel like that's what I should do. To have it be, like, a realistic rebuild. Um, but we're gonna rip a couple more of these and then I gotta cut it off, dude. We're just losing. We're just losing right now. We get a Joe Montana. That's not too bad. I'm gonna give it, like, five more packs, dude. We'll give it, like, five more, or around there. And then, and then we gotta cut it off. We gotta stop this. This is not, this is not good. This is just not it. I'll take the 85, actually. I'm not gonna take a gold over an 85. But, dude, these packs, man. Show us the odds, EA. Come on. Give us a back. We just wanna know what we're pulling. We don't care how bad they are. We just want to see it. That's so annoying. They had it there. They were fire. And then it, they turned bad. And the odds were just gone. Like, I just I just think that's really funny. <clears throat> we got three left. Dang, man. Were you guys packs better than this today? Or, or am I just having a bad day? Or did they lower odds on everything? We get a Darnell Mooney right there. Fifty card, DRC. Okay, actually, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna rip 
one ultimate legends fantasy pack to end it off bro that's what we're gonna do why not rip just one i love these packs maybe we can get some fire out of this give me hype that that's what i'm thinking right now that's what i'm thinking we get an 86 lamar out of the first we'll take that and we'll take these 78s 79s we get a richard seymour a joe montana deacon jones and ricky jackson that was a bummy that was bummy okay no rings big rings let's go big rings let's go Derek Thomas. Okay, I'll take the Derek Thomas. I'm gonna get greedy. I'm gonna get greedy and rip one more. I'm ripping one more. You guys are getting some bonus content. I love these packs. I said I was gonna stay away from them, but why would I just stay away? Like, I wanna rip a couple. We get an Adam Shaheen there to start it off. That's pretty solid. Um, boom, boom. And um, I'll take the 78. Second round is a different type of bummy right now. No rings. You kidding me? Yes! Let's go! Let's go! Calvin Johnson! A 97 overall! Oh my gosh! Let's go! Let's go, bro. Let's go! Let's go! Hold on. How much is he going for? How much is that Calvin going for? 200k. I mean, that's profit, bro. I think we rip one more. I think we rip one more of these babies. They're fun. They're so fun. And since those pro fantasies are so bad, the people who watch to the end of this video, they deserve, they deserve to see these packs at the end because those pro fantasies were brutal. They were really bad. I really wasn't going to touch these packs, but those were just so bad, dude. We get a Warren Sapp there. We'll take Warren, and then we will snag him and him. We get a UL in the second round, which is solid. Derek Thomas, Junior Seau. This is my last pack, I promise. I'm done after this. I, I cannot rip more. Okay. Okay. 95 Derek Thomas and no big rings there. So we're going to walk out with a 97 Megatron and 295 Derek Thomases. So we didn't lose too many coins ripping these. But I'm going to wrap this up now. We had to give you guys some bonus content for those pro fantasies being so bad. But uh, hope you guys liked it. Make sure you drop a like, comment down below, sub to the channel if you're new. Tomorrow we will be ripping some store packs. We'll do, be doing some profane, or no, store packs varieties tomorrow. That's the plan. And then Tuesday, hopefully I'll have that rebuild done and out. But that's the plan. Hope you guys liked it. I will catch you tomorrow. Hopefully whatever store packs they drop are going to be some fire. And uh, those Ultimate Legends were fun. I love ripping those packs, dude. Let's go. But see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching.